Hi there, in this video I am going to explain the concept of safe area. The safe area of a view means the area which is not being overlapped by a bar like status bar or the navigation bar or the tab bar. In other words, it is the area in which we can display the content which we do not want to be overlapped by these bars. So. The idea here is that we do not pin the content like the labels or the text views and the similar stuff to the actual edges of the view controller's main view because if we do so, they can be overlapped by the status bar or the navigation bar. They are pinned to the safe area so that they are visible to the user. And on the other hand, there are situations in which we need to According to the requirements, we need to pin the views to the actual edges of the view controller's main view instead of its safe area. So, in the case of the background images or sometimes in the case of table views that, that cover the entire screen or the collection views, they are pinned actually sometimes they are pinned to the actual edges of the view controller's main view so so that they are displayed appropriately on the devices like iphone x and the other newer devices like iphone xr and iphone xs so here i will explain the concept with the help of an example i will drag and drop a ui view onto the canvas and I will change its background color to red and now I will give it some constraints to pin it to the edges of the view controller's main view and here I will change the constants to zero to pin the right view to the edges of the view controller's main view but here as you can see if I Click the drop down indicator. Here, the safe area option is selected instead of view, which means the actual edges of the view controller's main view. Here, similarly, in other cases, the safe area option is selected. So, what does it mean? It means that a red view will be pinned to the safe area of the view controller's main view instead of its actual edges. So, here I will add these four constraints. And now I will run the app to see the results. So now here as you can see that the right view has not been extended to the actual edges of the view controller's main view as you can see that some space here at the bottom and at the top is still white. So now I will edit the constraints and I will make the right view to extend to the actual edges of the view controller's main view, I will edit the top constraint and I will change the safe area dot top to superview dot top and here I will change the constant to zero. And similarly I will edit the bottom constraint and I will change the safe area dot bottom to say to superview dot bottom and now I will run the app again to see the results and now as you can see that the red right view has covered the entire screen and it is extending to the actual edges of the view controller's main view it is not in this case it, it is not pinned to the safe area of the view controller's main view Actually, its top and bottom is not pinned to the safe area of the view controller's main view, but they are 
pin to the actual edges of the view controllers main view so here the idea is to pin the background images to the literal edges of the view controllers main view but not to pin the content like labels and the text views and the buttons to the actual edges of the view controllers main view but instead to pin them to the safe area so that they are not covered by the status bars or the navigation bars or the tab bars.